leave a message if you're good looking. Hi, Paul. It's me, Rex. I'm in Alice Springs. About half way, I suppose. Been a hell of a ride so far, you know. Uh, this young uh, black fella nearly picked the windscreen in William Creek, so I gave him a lift. And then he, he robbed me in Udnadana. But his wife reminded me of, of you, you know. Anyhow, uh, I'll call again. Oh, you're precious, mate. Fucking precious. Oh. And what, you got raw hide knackers. Triple thinking. Having problems with your abo neighbours? Just give them a house. Oh. I don't want your house. I don't want you, dog. You're a a gutless fool. Call me and tell me about your adventures. Don't you dare call me again. Don't you fucking dare! Hello? Polly? It's really fucking early. Paul, about five years ago, I was going to ask you to marry me. I gotta go, Rex. Paul, I'm sorry. I gotta go. Nah, no, Noel here. Polly's cousin. She's moved in across the road. You got the number eight? Yeah. Yeah, mate. Hello? Paul. It's me. I'm still here. You sound... far away. Darwin. That's far enough. He moves into the house. Yeah, it's quieter here. I miss your ex. Not much of me left to miss. Yes. What? Yes. That's what I would have said if you'd asked me to marry you. It sounds weird to say it now. All the shit we've talked, all the shit we haven't. I love you. Always have. There it is. There it is. And if you were here right now holding my hand, I'd never let go, Rexy. Never, ever. I love you too, Paul. <laughs> 